From the Journal of Aphromus Longjourney. Pilgrim. With notes by Avos Tor, scholar of Reeve Library. Ma Day, 19th cycle, 7th year, 81st turn. 43rd day in the trees. We left Pella Vapel this morning, leaving with the good wishing of our hosts, as well as some fresh supplies. They were very generous, and our supplies will last us until we are out of the swamp and can do our own hunting again. There was a light rain this afternoon, but no more, and it looks as though it will be clear long enough for me to write this entry. Torn promised to keep an eye on the weather, so I should not be taken unaware. I looked at the book again this evening. There are words there, but they are in no script I have read. The pictures accompanying these words show a large beast, like the crocodiles that lie on the banks of the Tresco. However, the humans in the picture with it are completely dwarfed. There is a scale picture which shows it as ten times longer than their height. If Torn is a typical specimen, this would make the creature the size of a large dragon. However, a dragon tends not to be built that way, having its legs coming down from its body, not from out of its sides. Also, the jaws are much the same as a crocodile's. I am fairly certain that it must be a related creature. Note. There are giant crocodiles found in the southern marshes of Ferswat that grow up to 25 feet long. However, I have heard of skeletons being found in the Jacoba wastes that were twice that length. There is also a picture of two humans in a room filled with books. The older one is shouting at the younger one, and they are both watched by a rat. The humans both wear robes. Note, this scene seems familiar to me, but I cannot think why. This book puzzles me greatly.